Welcome back, Random TV Reviews, your girl in that. And it's your boy, Stanley. All right, Empire. I'm gonna get the little stuff out the way first, and then we're gonna go into the big stuff because basically we had one scene this entire night. Yep. And then next week, it's not gonna come on. It's gonna come on the week after that. At this rate, we're never gonna finish Empire. This no. season will never end. It's gonna be this time, 2018, and we're still gonna be watching Empire. Yeah, so if y'all are new to the channel, welcome. Go ahead, hit that subscribe button. Go ahead and yeah. hit that like button. Do all that good stuff. If you're an old family member, y'all know what to do. Kick up your shoes and relax your feet. Yeah, and I know y'all probably really didn't care, but you know, just want to give us some apologies for the last two videos. The first one, the freaking thing cut off without our two up, two down. And then the last one, y'all had to watch us on the green screen without the freaking background. Yeah, it's so we apologize for that, but yeah, it might not be the first time it might happen again, but hey. It's life. That's right. We don't do this for a live, we do this for fun. Yeah. So we're going to start on off right. Get the light stuff out the way. We see Andre. Andre has a new therapist, and he's over at the <laughs> over in the <laughs> office, and he's talking to her to him about how much he is in like with Miss Pamela. But he was like obsessed. He, he said, "I just want to call her, but the way my family unit is set up, they don't take too well to the law, and I, I'm kind of sleeping with the law." Yeah. So at I'm some sleeping point, with the enemy. Yeah. So at some point. It ain't going to end well for me, so yeah. I don't know what to do, Doc. And then he just started acting real erratic. And Doc said, you know what? Before you leave, I'm going to go ahead and get you to re-up on that prescription. I'm yeah, gonna... I'm going to write you another prescription. So you go ahead and <laughs> take this with you on your way to court. Get that filled at the Walgreens and you'll be all right. I said, is it that easy to get met? But okay. It is that easy for Andre. Well, he does have a track record. Yeah, he did. So then over at Empire, some kind of way, Jay Papa don't made his way back to Empire because he said he Because he broke. Be, he <laughs> said he want to be a part of the 20 for 20. Uh-huh. And he's going to do some Christian trap music, basically. And I was here for it. Yeah. So he gets on over there to Empire. And of course, him and Becky, they immediately had this. Clash. Mm -hmm. Oh. So, Sean, they was in the studio, and he was laying down his tracks or whatever, sounding good, doing whatever he got to do. Sean said, I ain't usually into this Jesus thing right here. <laughs> but he said, this song is tight right here. I can get with this. I said, okay, uh-huh, that's what you're supposed to do. And he said, you know what? I'm known to catch the Holy Ghost every day. And then I said, when, Sean? <laughs> yeah, when? when? Mm -hmm. Yeah. I'll wait. Well, so, when he was six. <laughs> Becky came in and she started critiquing J Papa stuff and you could tell it was way more than about the music. It was a personal. It was personal. Told Shine, get clear the room. He said, So do you want me to get you something out of the kitchen while I'm gone? She said, just 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 clear the room. She told J Papa, listen, come this way, because I'm not gonna come talk to you, you through the glass. Like I'm gonna tell her at a bank. Listen, this is what it's gonna be. Don't disrespect me, don't undermine me. He said, You so cute when you get married. Yeah. Mm, and next day we know he had her on top of the soundboard uh -huh. messing all the keys up. Yep, I said that's exactly what it was. She was pissed off that he left her the way that he did. Well, check this out. Moving forward, Jay Popper really does want something with Becky. Becky don't got hit off and don't got that dust knocked off of there. And now she will tell him something about something. You know uh -huh. what? I'm glad that we were able to do get, what we did. And get some closure. Get some closure. Because I worked too hard to get in the position that I'm in to make anything seem unprofessional. So right now, we just have a yeah, professional this, relationship. This is, gonna, this is gonna be professional. He was looking like his heart was broke. Say, so you just used me for my name? But I'm gonna tell you what, I'm gonna tell you what she's doing. Oh, I know. She did him exactly like he did her. Left her broken. So no, now she chose though. She chose. She would not go with him. What I'm saying is, <laughs> I don't have time. What was that? What was that move? That move where they were talking about the laws of uh, laws of um, energy says neither lost nor destroyed. It just simply transferred from one part to the next. next. So she was taking her negative energy that he had because he left and she didn't want to go. She was hurt. I think she wanted him to stay. But he wanted to go to travel. 
because he made all the millions. I think that's how he got a deal somewhere in, else. In other words, she was salty towards him. She was pissed off. Now it's her opportunity to transfer that back to him and leave it there. And leave it there. I gave it to you because I ain't gonna argue with you tonight. Yeah, you ain't gotta argue with me. So listen. It's all right. All right, so y'all know last week Lucia said that he was back. Well, he came back just in time. Yeah, he snapped. He clicked back in just in time. Because now it's time to go to court and go to this um this custody hearing. When they get to the courthouse, the judge was like, you know what? I don't give a care. I don't care who y'all are. And at mm -hmm. the end of the day, the well-being of that child is what I'm going to be after. That's so right. So if you got any cameras, get out. Get Media, out. Media, get out. Any signs, get out. Next thing we know, we see this guy. Free Bella. She, she said, said, one more clown is out the circus. Get we don't have time. I'm like, this. did you not just hear what she just said? Just, just, just crazy. So Black in the courthouse, we got Councilman Tate Diggs. He's representing Anika. He gets up there and his opening remarks was basically, Lucius and Cookie are the hood by their client. They, they, they hood mafia. Yeah. They dangerous. They this, they that. Now, Hakeem, the daddy of Bella, he's a B-list um, yeah. hip-hop star. Yeah. A whore. Sexist. And he do drugs. Uh -huh. He do all this. So basically, he was laying it on thick. They, everybody in the family crazy. They're criminals. They this, that. And at this rate, if Bella's in their custody, she's going to be hurt or even dead. Even dead. I was like, come on now. You know this. I said, so So this is just what we're doing. So they started putting different people on the witness stand. Blah, 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 blah. Then they got the Tiana. I'm going to speed this up because I'm going to get to the ones that were juicy. They could put Tiana on the stand. He, Councilman Tate Diaz, going to ask her, how long you been living with Hakeem? Oh, so how many threesomes y'all had in that marble tub? What kind of drugs y'all take? Was it crack cocaine? Was it heroin? Was it was West Allen? Heroin? Heroin? <laughs> you know, I, leave me alone. Let me share it my own way. Y'all know what it is. Dope. And then he just clicked off. Tell me. Tell me what it is. Tell me. It got all in her face. But, but I was confused because Why the other lawyer was saying, objection, objection. And she was like, Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And I said, mm -hmm, when is this mm -hmm, judge gonna put him like, out? Yeah, that don't happen. Said, for look at that woman, Judge Maybelline. I think she would have smacked the skit out of him. But uh, your favorite lady, uh huh, Judge Judy. Judge Judy. Stella hates Judge Judy. <laughs> well, she was said, do this <laughs> out of my courtroom now. How should do it? Yeah, <laughs> you on my time. You can't say nothing in her courtroom. So yeah, Councilman um, Man, you Tate can't even blow your nose. You going to jail? <laughs> He totally clicked off. So now they had to go into recess. Out in the hallway, now we got Hakeem clicking off on Tiana talking about something you couldn't handle yourself under pressure. And it's going to be your fault that I lose my baby. Said, and it's your skit. fault that we even here because we could be in Cuba right about Boo now. But you snitch. Tiana said, you know what? I wish you well. Hope for you. I hope that when you come back to your right mind. Yeah, you'll I know you're under stress right now. Yeah. But just know that when you do, I ain't going to be here. Yeah. And she walked right. I said, that's what you do. You I hear I hear. She'll be right back. But she'll be right back. She'll be right back on over there. Yeah. So then we got Cookie. They put her on the stand. Now, he tried it. He tried to use her past against her. But Cookie, is, she, she's a good talker. Oh, yeah. She was like, you know what? At the end of the day, I made my mistakes. I did this. Yes, I was in prison because I was trying to make my life. I was trying to live out, get my dream. You know, get my dream off the Try ground. Trying to live my dream, but I made some mistakes but in I the process. I made some mistakes. But what I will tell you is that my son, my son is a great father. He's he's able to be the parent that I wish I could have been to him. You know, he's loyal he, to that baby. He does everything for that baby. His, his routine has changed. He's changed as a man. He's grown up. Da 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 da. So they were looking like, oh, okay, mm -hmm. all right, she did good. Now Lulu, since he he just came back yesterday. Yeah. The white left the building and Lulu came back. He talking about something. I I would like to be put on the stand. Man. Everybody said, no, 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 I'm no, like, no, no, no. it's too heavy, yeah. dude. You it's just not a good idea. You don't remember nothing. Oh, we ain't we ain't tested and tried you yet. Yeah. To see if so you, we didn't put your batteries back in yet, so we don't know if you working or not. So Lucius get up on that day on stand. Did y'all notice how he took that leg and and swung that leg around? I said, you was really uh -huh. playing this Putting part. Putting it on now. So Councilman Tate, they start asking him questions, talking about something. You were named the um, scariest man of the year in, in 2000, da 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 Why? He I said, don't uh, remember. No, he said, he said, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> he sounds just like other guy in that um con in that Congress hearing yesterday. 
I don't know. Mm -hmm. I don't know. So started asking him something else, you know, this, that, and the third. I don't know. So you, you, you've you heard a lot of people, and sometimes when things don't go your way, people end up hurt or they disappear. What I do now is someone tried to blow me up. Yeah. And it changed my life forever. <laughs> that baby, she gives me a reason to want to live. To have, boy, to have, have new memories. And oh my God, I love her. I do. I love her. I said, tell us, what, tell us what's like. Okay. I said, are you about to cry? I uh, said, Lucia's over there finessing the hell out of him. Got him. Good. And at the end of the day, he said, I had a strategy. I knew what I was doing. Yep. I said, you see, y'all had, okay. yeah. yeah, had to trust me. Yeah. Y'all had to trust. Y'all had to trust the process. So now they out there for another break. I said, God, doing how many breaks, breaks they get? Now I said, this TV. I don't think they have that many breaks. So now they out in the hallway. And Hakeem's lawyer basically told him, say, at the end of the day, you're still young. And what went through Hakeem's big head was, don't you tell me I'm still young and I have time enough to have more children if this don't work out well for me. He said, you know what, dude, you're fired. Mm -hmm. Everybody said, ho, 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 ho Hakeem, the, the pump your yeah. guys on break. Yeah, yeah. And why are you acting so freaking erratic? You're in court. Yeah. Like, like. There's not whispering, um, listening ears around the corner. But anyway. But his lawyer should never say that Buzz get dumped. He should you, you, Buzz, you need to keep it positive all the way through the whole thing. You being paid, you're going to say, yeah, it's a great chance. I, I can't guarantee you, but it's a great chance you can get your daughter back. But don't tell me I'm too young, or that I'm young, and I have plenty of time to have some more kids. Yeah, that's I can't have like, another Bella. Yeah, that's just like if your child passes away and somebody tell you some stupid stuff. Yeah, somebody, yeah, you be still okay. Young. You still young. You can have some. Uh, no, that's, that's that? my baby. Yeah, I won't so, never be able to get a baby to replace that baby. Mm -mm, you and you don't want to. It ain't like I can go back down Walmart and get one off the airway. Yeah. So um, yeah, he fired his lawyer and he said he's gonna represent himself. They was like, nah, oh, you full of head. Nah. Cookie said, boy, you stupid. You stupid, you stupid, you stupid, you don't know. So <laughs> Lucia said, well, maybe it's not a bad idea. Cookie said, shut up. <laughs> you don't know him. You don't even remember how stupid he is. <laughs> so so Lucia was looking at her like, oh, was it that bad? <laughs> <laughs> it was so, like, he ain't never had no strategy. <laughs> So even Thursday was like, I don't think it's a good idea. This ain't a good idea. I don't, do you know what you're doing? He was laying out of his seat like this. Uh -huh. I said, said Thursday, <laughs> get yourself together. So Hakeem decided he wanted to bring Anika onto the witness stand. I said, oh, I see his strategy. I said, I see what I you're see doing. I see your strategy, ma'am. So his strategy was. Since you want to be the sole parent of this baby, mm -hmm. let me ask you some questions that a parent would know about their child. So he went down, what's the favorite fruit? What fruit makes a belly hurt? What's her favorite color? What books does she like to hear when she's going to sleep? What kind of music does she like? What does she call her pop-pop? Uh-huh. What is she afraid of? Um, um, I was, she, well, she was in formula when I went to jail and this, that, and the third, da 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 Didn't know nothing. So the judge was looking at Anika like, so you want custody of this baby, but you don't even know parenting one on one about this mm -hmm. baby. Hold on. Then Hakeem hit her with the with the ooh. -ooh. He said, Listen, since you've been out, my door has always been open. I said, Conda Hakeem, I ain't gonna give you all the way 95%. Yeah. My door's always been open. I've never tried to shut you out of Bella's life. But then this is what you try to do to me. You try to shut me out of hers. I would never do that to you. So her will started, she started looking crazy. Mm -hmm. Councilman Tay D started looking crazy. Yep. And at this point, I'm like, oh. I, I, Hakeem done brought this home. He, he Matter of fact, he ain't got to pay that lawyer. He, for, he, he represented himself. So next thing we know, they went out for another break. And they, they basically having a, a pre-celebration party in the hallway. Hey, you about to get your mm -hmm. daughter back. This, that, and the third, blah, 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 blah. Mm. And then all of a sudden, you hear this dark cloud. Yeah. Walk through the hallways. And I said, well, who the hell is that? Well, it ain't nothing but Mrs. Dubois. The devil. And Mrs. Dubois walked in there looking like, y'all remember when she yanked up Vanessa when she went out to see Rat? What is it, the Ratchet? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and she looked like, don't you say. I said, you know what? All of them froze up. 
They was like, what's she doing here? Huh? What? She was brought up as a rebuttal witness. Now, I ain't never heard of that. I ain't never heard of that either. Yeah, that goes against my um, my criminal activity. <laughs> yeah, I ain't, I ain't never been that much in trouble. Somebody got to come and rebuttal. My, my God, don't take it. I, I heard what you was about to say. Uh -huh. so, so, next thing we know, Kelsey and Tay Diggs, well, first Thurston was like, listen, dude. He covered in my head and said, is there anything you need to tell me? To, you need uh, to tell me, me now. Yeah. How can... Mm -mm, mm -mm. I don't have nothing to tell you. I don't know that lady. Oh, yeah. I ain't never seen her that day in my life. Yo. <laughs> well, Miss Dubois got up there and she said, Yeah, I know um, Hakeem. He's a fine gentleman. That family of his is real sketchy. Well, why would you say something like that? He told me. He comes to my house every Tuesday for the last five months and spends time with me and Bella. They was like, What? Oh, I have tapes. I have. So. And the videotapes were video and audio. Yep. Of Hakeem talking skit and spilling all the family tea. Mm -hmm. Andre Crazy, <laughs> Jamal. Jamal Pop Hills, mm -hmm. Mama Violet, Daddy Crazy. Crazy. Wish my mama was still in jail. Say, Kai, don't. What? But I have one problem with this rebuttal freaking witness. If I would, if I was the judge, what I would have said, mm -hmm. why didn't you show me this bug skit right out the gate? And how do you know? Yeah. Why, why? Why are you cooperating with her like this? Yeah. And and number two was how was why was this recorded? For what purpose was this recorded? For real? Cause they all yeah no they were about it. because I'm pretty sure Hakeem didn't know he was being recorded. No he didn't. Cause he wouldn't never even said that. Cause I thought stupid. I thought it was the law that you can't record nobody and do no bullshit without their permission. They talking about in that state that you can do that bullshit, but I thought you had to have consent. I did too, but I don't. Even YouTube don't let you post nobody else's stuff on YouTube. <laughs> but you can go into court and play a video. I can video you doing anything because I had consent. We can put it up on the screen. That so that my thing is, why in the hell did that come up at first to discredit him to being a father of Bella? Why I had to come after he, he challenged her of not knowing Bella? Mm. And then all of a sudden, Mama came back from whatever freaking Murder. part of hell she was in. She showed up. Mm. Well, after this was all said and done, family went out in the hallway again. They said, hey. You just lost your goddamn yeah. daughter. Thursday, you just lost your daughter. You lost your daughter. Now, the whole family is mad with Hakeem. Like, boy, you just as stupid as they come. You basically spilled all of our family information mm -hmm. to the devil, to the enemy. Are you freaking serious? Andre was looking at him like, so I'm crazy now? So I'm crazy now? <laughs> oh, okay. I'm sitting up here. I could be getting laid right now, but I'm in this courtroom yeah. with you. Where's Pamela at? Where is she? Where's Pamela? Jamal looking like, hey, where my dude at because... Oh, a pop of yeah, pills? pills? Yeah. Whatever. Deuces. <laughs> Lucius looked at his son and said, get your way up. Let's go back in. <laughs> well, he did. He lost custody of the baby. Baby got to go over there with Anika. She got full custody of, the, of baby Bella. Based off of this guy doing information. I said, you know, because the judge but said, was, I don't think. It still was too easy, though. I don't think that she will be safe around you and your family. I said, oh, ain't this some bull that's, yeah. that's some bull. But I hate I hate when people use a baby to get revenge. Yeah, it's leverage. Yeah, it, it's like at the end of the day, the one that's going to suffer is Bella. Mm -hmm. She's the one, you know, she's been snatched from her father, which Hakeem was allowing her to come over, but she wanted to kind of take control of the baby. He wouldn't let her take control because she didn't know him. And I guarantee you, she gonna be bringing that baby back soon because Bella is gonna give her a run for the money because she do not know her. Hmm. Cause when babies get that age and they they set their yeah, ways, setting their ways, <laughs> they just they just like senior citizens. Yeah. No, 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 no offense against y'all, senior citizens. <laughs> seasoned uh, seasons, yeah, seasoned. Cause y'all like to be called seasoned yeah. citizens. But when you got, if you like your coffee with <laughs> uh, one pack of creamer. One pack of sugar and a splash of got doing uh uh uh, uh yeah. I don't care what anybody say. <laughs> you will whoop somebody's beep if you don't get it your way. And don't let you be in church. Oh hell no. 
We're gonna move on. From yeah. That. <laughs> don't sing your song on Sunday. We're gonna move we gonna, on. Oh, uh, we don't sing your song on Sunday. Don't let you testify. Why you got a chance? You gonna burn the whole goddamn church back. Church. But everybody in it. What's the famous word? Church ain't what it used to be. Yeah. As soon as you get home, you go pick up that goddamn telephone that we call it and call a pass and complain that you couldn't have your way. And then the next week he give but you a little moment. We still love you though. Mm -hmm. So, Miss Dubois and Cookie Lion had a face off in the bathroom. Cookie basically told her you can go to the, to to hell. Go to hell. Yeah. And told her ain't enough soap in here that will clean your dirty ass. Yeah. So Cookie at this point she is she's fed up. You don't mess with the baby now. You don't mess with the baby yeah, line. Yeah, you destroy that. Yeah. And the part that got got to me about this judge was, didn't you hear Cookie say that Anika begged her to take Bella when she was in trouble? Yeah. She was getting ready to commit suicide and jump off a ledge when she and was pregnant. That, and none of that mattered. And she talked off that ledge. Yeah. Okay. Whatever. None of that mattered. I said okay. So next thing we know. What else happened? God darn, I forgot. Then uh, we get back to the house and um, Lucius at this point, he is pissed off. Mm -hmm. Pissed off to the highest. Cause you know, freaking Bella was everything to Lucius. Mm -hmm. Matter of fact, she calls Cushus, yeah. Cushus. Calmed him down a whole lot too. He said, I want to see blood. The kind that pours, uh -huh. the kind that runs like a river. And Cooker was looking at him like, yeah, yeah that's, you bet. that's it Lucius. I know right there. And he said, this leg right here, Ain't gonna get in my way. I said, "Oh, okay." So, um, now we see uh, Miss Dubois. She basically having a round table meeting. Yeah. They over there. Ha ha ha! We won. We did this. We did that. We did Say, this. Oh, and Anika, good. you're with a nice um, a, a nice family with some status where you belong. And da 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 da. Blah, 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 blah. And next thing we know, we seen this white dude pop up. And I said, "Oh hell no!" So that's Andre's got the one therapist. He said, "Oh." So that whole family is, oh my God, they're coming at them at every angle possible, which they said they would. Yeah. So the they're going to pick them apart one by one. The therapist said, oh, I saw my favorite client today. Oh, and I upped, <laughs> I upped his meds. I said, oh, skip. Oh, he already crazy. You going to make him times 10? Why'd you do that? <laughs> Let's not say crazy because people be all in their feelings. He's touched. Yeah. Touched by an angel. <laughs> I said, so this is about to go real wrong. It's about to go left. Now, oh, oh, go ahead, I was going oh, to say, I don't think they needed to use a whole episode for that. I think that could have been like a five or ten minute snippet and we could have moved on to more Lucius. But that's just my opinion. Yeah, so then the U.S. Marshals brought Anika by to pick up Baby Bella. And um, Hakeem basically gave her the one-on-one -on -one parenting mm -hmm. that she did not know in the courtroom about yep. everything that Bella did, needed. How she likes to be put down. She likes to be fed with a tennis ball in her hand. Don't ask me why. Yeah. She just does. Her favorite color is her. yellow. Yeah. And basically he kissed his daughter goodbye. And Anika was looking like, I know I made a mistake. Made a mistake. And it was it. As soon as the door closed, you can hear Bella screaming out of her mind. And that's what's going to happen. She's going to yep. give you a run for your money. Straight from the VA. The dirty, dirty sound. Two up, two down. Holla.